Alexa, it's game time. Okay. You can use Alexa with your Xbox to do cool stuff like that. You can launch games or apps. Alexa, tell Xbox to launch NBA 2K23. Sure, launching NBA 2K23 for Xbox Series XS. Of course, turn the Xbox on or off and a lot more. But first, you have to set it up. Now, I'm using an Amazon Fire TV with Alexa built in. Really great TV, has HDR, screen looks great, you know, games look great, and they're also really inexpensive. But your TV does not have to have Alexa built in in order to use it with your Xbox. You can use any Alexa device or even Alexa on your phone to control your Xbox. So let's go ahead and get this set up. First, go to settings, general, power options, and set the sleep as your power plan. It will say active down here. Then press B to go back to settings, head down to devices and connections, digital assistance, and enable digital assistance. All right, we're done here. Next, head to your phone and download the Alexa app if you don't have it. Once you have it, you're all logged in and set up. Open it up, go to more, select skills and games, search for Xbox, select it, and enable. Then you'll need to link your Microsoft account, the same one that you use for your Xbox. Tap yes and you're linked. Now this next part seems to work differently for some people. Usually you can just go to devices and manually add your Xbox, but if that doesn't work and it didn't work for me, here's what I did. Of course, if it discovered your Xbox during the initial scan, hey, that's great. Just follow the on-screen prompts, give it a name, and you're all set up and ready to use Alexa with your Xbox. But if it didn't discover the Xbox during the scan, no problem cancel setup, head back to the Xbox app in Alexa. Now you probably don't have to do this part. You can probably just go right to devices, but just in case I like to do this first because it does seem to help some people. And now that we're already signed in, this time click launch. I'll just choose the closest Alexa, it doesn't matter. It's gonna work with any of them once we get this set up. Tap launch. Now first, make sure your Xbox is turned on and you are signed in. Come to Devices, tap the plus, select Add Device, scroll down to Game Console, choose Xbox, and scan for the Xbox. Now it should find it this time, provided that the Xbox is turned on and signed in. All right, so if it's not on, turn it on. If you're not signed in, sign in, all right? So then it should find your Xbox, all right? So once it does, just follow the on-screen prompts, name it whatever you want, and you can just skip this part because there is no Alexa app for Xbox, at least at the moment. Even if you're able to find it, you'll see it's currently unavailable. No problem, you don't need it anyway. Skip choose an Alexa device, and don't worry, you'll be able to use any Alexa with your Xbox after you get set up. And now you're all set up and ready to use Alexa with your Xbox. So then you can do things like this. Alexa, turn on the TV. Okay. Alexa, turn on the Xbox. Okay. Alexa, switch the TV input to HDMI 1. Okay. Alexa, turn on the TV lights. Okay. Brown performance so far, hence the big lead. Well, if I was... Alexa, turn off the Xbox. Okay. Alexa, turn off the TV. Okay. Alexa, turn off the TV lights. Okay. 
All right, so that's pretty cool. But, you know, I have multiple things that I need to turn on, and that just took way too long, right? And it's cutting into our game time, which is not good, right? We want to play some games, man, right? But we can easily fix that problem by creating groups or a routine. So head back in to the Alexa app, and I'm going to go for a routine. But, you know, a group may work better for you. Just depends on, you know, what you're trying to do. Tap more, tap routines, hit the plus, give your routine a name. Tap the plus next to when this happens, select voice, and then type out what you want to say to trigger the routine. I think I'll go with it's game time or maybe just game time. And then I can add another phrase just in case I say it differently. And this time I will go with it's game time. Feel free to add a third phrase. Could be anything you want, you know, shiver me timbers, you know, literally whatever you want to say. Then tap the plus next to add action. And there's a lot of options here. And it also depends on the devices that you have. All right. So feel free to explore. But here's how I'm going to set this up. I'll start with the Fire TV. Power on. Next, add another action, smart home, lights, and I want the TV lights. Next, and now I'll choose the option for the lights. I want power and on. I can even set, you know, a certain brightness or a certain color, but I always leave them on Xbox green, so that's going to be the default color anyway. But of course, feel free to choose something here if you wish. Next, add another action. This time I'll choose custom and type out, set the TV input to HDMI one. Since you know, that is where my Xbox is plugged in. Now, of course, if you have CEC enabled, then you should be able to set this up to where your TV automatically switches, you know, when your Xbox comes on, but I don't want to, uh, you know, I don't want my TV set up that way. All right, next, add another action, smart home. Game consoles, choose the Xbox, power, and on. Next, add another action, smart home, lights. And I want the bed lights to come on, so I'll choose power and on. Again, you can set the brightness and color, otherwise, they'll just come on to what they were set at previously. All right then save. Next, I'll come back to routines and create a new routine. I'll call this one game over. What happens when voice. And then when I say game over, I want to trigger the routine. Add an action, fire TV, power off. Next, of course, if you have a different TV that's also compatible with Alexa, you can just set that up in the same way, like with a Roku TV or some Samsung TVs, LG TVs, etc., etc. Next, add an action, smart home, lights, TV lights. Next, power, and this time I want them to go off. Next, add action, smart home, Game consoles, power, and off. Actually, you know, I don't think I'm going to do this because it's already easy enough to turn the console off using the controller. And I don't want to accidentally turn the Xbox off in the middle of a game. You know, if I'm yelling, game over, man, you know, after beating a boss or something, right? So I'm going to back out of this. But of course, feel free to set this up, you know, however you want. All right. But this is all I really need. I want to leave the bed lights on. Of course, I can always turn those off simply by saying, Alexa, turn off the bed lights, you know? All right, so I think we're done here. Tap save, and now we'll test out our routines. Alexa, it's game time. Okay. And we are ready to play just by saying it's game time.
And you could even do this from a different room or even from your car for some reason, you know, if you just want everything up and ready when you get there. You can also launch games. Alexa, tell Xbox to launch Fortnite. Okay, starting up Fortnite. Capture gameplay. Alexa, tell Xbox to take a screenshot. Got it. And more. Then, when I'm done playing, I'll just use the controller to turn off the Xbox and then say, Alexa, game over. So that is how to set up your Xbox with Alexa and create routines. And I really encourage you to explore the Alexa app if you're unfamiliar with it and experiment with, you know, setting up your own groups and routines. In fact, you could even have routines that launch a certain game, you know, and maybe change the color of the lights. Maybe it starts playing a certain song or a certain album, which obviously I can't show you here for copyright reasons, but I could do this. Alexa, Agent 47 has a new contract. Sounds good. Starting Hitman 3. So once again, that is how to set up your Xbox with Alexa and create routines. So that way you're not messing around with remotes, you're not messing around with apps, you know, for your lights, and you can get to playing much faster. You know what time it is, don't you? Alexa, it's game time. <laughs>